This is the Rich Eisen Show. Show. Hit the drop. The line dropped. Michael Tufo, did you cut John off? We're about to get his question. The line dropped. The Rich Eisen Show. I am a peacock. You gotta let me fly. Is he still there? TJ Jefferson before the show <laughs> says out loud, any of you remember the player Luis Gonzalez? He's the one who fisted a base hit over the drawn-in infield uh, off, I mean, of, that's... off of Mariano Rivera. You were at that yeah, game, with right? Susie. Susie was covering it for, yeah. for, for Fox Sports. I was covering it for ESPN. And as if I needed another just cherry on top, kick in the groin, a Yankee who shall go unnamed right here put his phone number on a baseball and handed it to Susie in front of me. <laughs> what? Wait, that that <laughs> Wait, what? That happened. Does she still have that baseball? I don't know. That'd be it. I think she might. What do you think would be the best choice for the Niners three overall? On the surface, what I think Trey Lamb has the potential both in terms of makeup, intelligence, athletic ability, height, weight, speed, running ability, all the different things that he can do. He's the guy who... I really like out of this entire group. I am a big fan of Trey Lance. How about that? A big fan. You celebrated it by wearing the Rock and the New Bengals jersey in a in a hockey league medium, which was I, th- I think a choice personally. But you uh, may have Rich, the flaw on that. Kyle. I will see your 17 <laughs> drafts hosted this year. It <laughs> brings you a blurb in Muscle and Fitness magazine. There were many sorry, remarks sorry, on that, that the Cincinnati Bengals sent us a jersey that might have uh, been mislabeled and intended for Kay Adams. It ended up on <laughs> me because it was very small. I felt like a mid-90s Ron Gant once he found <laughs> the, the way, weight room. Amazing reference. Amazing reference. 